Tonight, new developments on the NYPD officers ambushed in the Bronx. The suspect, 45 year old Robert Williams, now facing a list of charges, including attempted murder. Police say this video shows Williams firing on officers inside the 41st police station in Longwood this morning. Police say Williams is the same man who shot at two officers sitting inside a patrol van last night. We have team coverage tonight, including reaction from Williams' family. But we want to begin with CBS 2's Hazel Sanchez. She's live outside the 41st precinct in the Bronx where that wild shootout took place. Hazel. Yeah, and Jessica, if you take a look behind me, you can see the yellow police tape still securing the crime scene here at the 41st Precinct Station House, where police say ex-con Robert Williams walked in with one goal in mind, to kill cops. Today, Police Commissioner Dermot Shea called the alleged gunman a coward. Police say surveillance video from inside the 41st Precinct Station House in the Bronx shows an armed and dangerous ex-con on a mission. Just before 8 o'clock Sunday morning, 45-year-old Robert Williams is seen raising his weapon and firing. The gunfire startles an officer who ducks for cover. Williams also dives to the floor after witnesses say his gun jammed. The weapon is seen sliding across the station house floor. At least a dozen officers rush in to subdue him. In the background, you can see an injured Lieutenant Jose Gotro in the white shirt after he was shot in the arm. This is not a crime gone bad. This is not a, a liquor store robbery interrupted that a tragedy erupts from. This is a premeditated assassination attempt. Police say this is the gun Williams used. Unknown yet if it's the same weapon used in the shooting of two officers in a police van just 12 hours earlier. But investigators believe Williams is responsible for that attack as well. It was a premeditated effort to kill and not just to kill other human beings, but to kill those who wear a uniform that represents all of us. Sunday morning, New York's finest lined up outside Lincoln Hospital, celebrating the release of Officer Paul Struffolino, who was shot in the chin and neck in Saturday night's ambush. It happened around 8.30 on Simpson Street in the Hunts Point section. Surveillance video shows the gunman shooting at the police van with Struffolino and his partner inside. This image taken as the suspect leaves the crime scene. What we're talking about here, quite frankly, is a cop killer. It's just our cops were so good, he didn't get them. Police say Williams did time in prison for attempted murder and was paroled in 2017. He has a long rap sheet, including arrests for assault, carjacking, and resisting arrest. Now, Police Lieutenant Jose Gotro, who was shot here this morning, is still being treated at Lincoln Hospital. We're told he's doing well, and he's expected to be released sometime tomorrow. We're live outside the 41st Precinct Station House in the Bronx. Hazel Sanchez, CBS 2 News.